We Like It Here was created by a bunch of different Ario Maker creators. I'm just gonna say, judging by this, oh, okay, yeah, I think this might be cool, chat. Let's go. Maker's Hut. Hey, Yoshi. Oh, you're just staring at me. That's not creepy. Oh, hello. These overworld badges indicate which talented creators designed a level. Oh, that's cool. Breaky, M Doggy, New Pointless, Donkey Mint, Revlug. Oh, he's got the cute one. GP Soul and Skags. Okay, that's very cool. Beat all the star levels to pass. Zero out of seven stars. Okay. Alrighty. Am I sure it's not Brake? I hate you. I feel like we're going three, one, two, four. Three, one, two, four. Oh, what the hell? Okay, these are just... And these, these, turbo, these turtles are uh, invincible to my, to my tactics. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> what a way to start off. Yes, this level called Step On Me. Oh. Maybe I should have started with one. Off to a great start. Well, I was not, I definitely wasn't ready for all of these items to just be moving ground, essentially. Let's go. The rules are broken. Oh, hey. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. <laughs> Thanks, I hate it. <laughs> oh, what kind of shoes did Mario get in this level? All right, chat. I've been married for a decade, okay? I've been married for a decade. Okay, I gotta go backwards. My wife is the third girlfriend that I've watched, had to watch Grey's Anatomy with. I say that like being married a, de a decade is a long time. I don't think there's a lot of people in this chat right now that have been married a decade, bruh. Nine this year? Uh, that's not 10. Shut up. Not relevant. <laughs> Stop bragging, your relationship sucks. <laughs> Oh, that was cool. How many girlfriends have I watched Star Wars because their significant others made them? Every one of mine. Damn it, I had it. Oh, oh okay, cool. Oh, that, okay, I got this. Whee! Oh, wait, oh, no, did I just... Damn it. Damn it. <laughs> Fucking trolls. Your thumbs get tired watching this? I knew it wasn't gonna work. Okay, that level was made by Bufflin. This level, you know what? I could I could tell that was one that he made, you know? Briquet and, or no, this isn't Briquet. What is happening here? Oh. Okay, that's interesting. Okay, this is cool. Uh, this act's sick, chat. I fucked up right there. Ugh. I'm losing my mind, chat. Um, oh, damn it. I didn't know what would happen there. <laughs> uh. 
Oh, that was cool. Okay. Yeah, this level's sick. <laughs> this level's fucking cool. I fucked up. Cool. Oh, this is okay. This is melting my brain right now. Can I not? <laughs> what am I doing? I like that there's more than one checkpoint. <laughs> oh, I got, okay, so I gotta knock it right early enough. Yeah, I like that these levels have like a bunch of checkpoints. Chat, there's 43 exits in this hack, by the way. Oh, shit. Yeah, there is 43 fucking exits in that. We might be on this for a hot minute. But if these first two exits, which are in level three, uh, world three, are in any indication, I think this is going to be a really, really solid play. Oh, I see the problem. Okay. Do, 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 do. Um. No! Am I making it look easier or is it easier than most hacks? Um. I mean, I'm, I'm a god gamer. Uh, what's hard? Things that are hard to some people are easy. The others, yada yada yada. And also, I wouldn't say that I'm making this look easy. I'm not getting a lot of like first tries through sections, you know what I mean? It's mostly uh, second tries. Okay, never mind. I got first, I got that section first try. YouTube who would have already beaten this? Uh, I don't think that's true. I, I'm just going to go ahead and say that's a lie because I know for a fact the YouTube video for this is going to be a lot longer than 24 minutes. Okay, bud. Just like that. Damn, how much is left in this? Feel like I might have got a little lucky there, chat. What a level. All right, another Bufflin. Classic Bufflin. That was level two. That was the second level we played so far in the hack. Oh, that was lame. This is a uh, classic Bufflin, by the way. Oh shit, this song's banging. Oh, this is dirty. This is the core from Undertale? Of course it's from Undertale. Why does everything from Undertale bang, man?
This is a cool level. Oh no! Oh, I need to go in that pipe. I'm like, what? I'm like, well, how do I get around those fuckers? I just need to go in the pipe chat. Undertale was a game that I thought I wouldn't like, and I ended up loving deeply. Like, I held off on playing it for a while, and I love it. The only thing I didn't like about it was everyone yelling at me that I played wrong. Oh my god, you killed the goat mom. Oh my god, you killed her. How could you kill the goat mom? I don't give a, I have no emotional attachment to the goat mom. I'd do it again. Y'all don't even know her name. Just call her goat mom. Okay. Undertale fanbase, why you still haven't tried it? Wait, I mean, what are they gonna do? Let's -a go! The game's fucking awesome. You should not worry about that. It's such a fucking good game. Activision and don't worry, no, they're not that rabid anymore. Makes 155 million a year, while Nintendo's CEO Shuntaro Furukawa makes 2.51 million dollars a year. This is 60 times more, and a great example of how Nintendo can allocate resources better. Instead of paying their CEO more, Nintendo can focus on what matters most to them, lawsuits against their biggest fans, like nine-year-old Paco Gutierrez. A pipe! Fuck you, Paco Gutierrez! And Undertale legitimately is one of the best RPG games I've ever played. Um, it's so good. It's so good. Um, hey! What a level. Am I gonna die here, right here? That was classic Bufflin, though. Listen, man. It's a tough economy. Oh, I see what's happening here, chat. That is the part of any fan base I hate. The one that acts like you have to be smart to get a dick joke. You know what I mean? This is tough. Yeah, this is melting my brain a little bit, chat, because I'm not controlling the spin jump. Damn it. Why do I keep wanting to hit that? Okay, that worked. That worked. Okay. That's not what I want to do. This is hard. Maybe they're done. Yeah. Might be the last speedrun sessions ever. I'm just joking. No, I think we're doing three or four in October, and that's it in America this year. Yeah. I mean, not even, I'll, I'll even be more specific. I'm trying to get one in Germany. I really want to get one in Germany. Germany is the speed running epicenter. What the fuck is happening here? I'm gonna do my best though. This is hard. All right, we made it. Untitled level. What, what am I doing? Oh, I can control it.
Wait, I'm so confused. I don't know what it- This is so confusing. Is this a Bufflin one? You can just time him out. Lies. Mario does not give a shit about this water. I'm so confused what I'm doing there. Uh, and I don't mean this in like a bad way, but when you are the smaller streamer in a, a closely knit pair, it, um, you're, um, always the copier. Yeah, you're the one who's always copying. Does that make sense? What? How am I dead? Okay. All right. I don't know what I'm doing here. What is it? What is this? What? Is, what is this? That looks like lava. What? Do I want water or not? Was I supposed to bring something with me? Fuck me in the ball dicks, piece of shit. This is definitely a level where I have to think about everything I'm doing. <laughs> this is one of those levels that's a really good concept chat, but I hate it. It's a, it's a great level, great level, right? I just don't like it. This is a deceptively tricky jump. Oh wait, I got it. What? What the hell? Oh, shit. This is tough, man. Wait, I'm... I don't know what to do. <laughs> no. Okay. I'm like five levels in and I'd say they're very good. None of them are too hard, but I wouldn't say any of them are easy, and there's a fucking shit ton of them. Okay. Oh. This level's like melting my brain. This level's not hard, but I, it's just so weird to figure out. You fuck face, Yoshi, I hate you. <laughs> I don't think anybody enjoys it. Honestly, everybody I know that plays League of Legends does not enjoy it. You prefer Mario hacks? That's all you watch? Yeah, I can't. I couldn't just do that. Oh my god, I got in. Who can't read? I don't read. Who am I for in Kendrick Drake beef? 
Yo, Kendrick Lamar just put on the best show I've ever seen. Like, I like Drake songs, but I don't like any Drake albums, whereas I love Kendrick albums. Um, poor J. Cole, you know what I mean? Uh, you're a bitch. I prefer the stomp. I got this. I got this. Don't have it. What is this song? <laughs> uh, what is happening here? Oh, that's not done. Okay. Okay. Fuck! Why didn't I just go for it? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I made it. Wait, how are you supposed to survive there? Oh, I guess you can't. Lame intentional death. Who designed this? Eye for an eye. Okay. Um. I think I get it. Maybe not. So I think I gotta kill it like that. So every time I kill something, it changes. But I gotta get, like... Uh... Yeah, this is a cool level. Okay, so that's not... Huh. Well, the problem is that I need to use him to go up. Oh. Melting my brain. <laughs> Chat, this is melting my brain. Have I tried getting up? They're like, not like super technical, like, you know, like a shell hack or anything where you're like, a ton of different, um... Ah, shit. Falling doesn't count. 
like a ton of different like inputs or anything. It's literally like brain usage, yeah, which is really fun. I really like. Ah! Hmm. I don't get it. I don't get it. What is happening here? It feels like it feels like that should be one block to the right and one block lower. Do you know the definition of insanity? I bet you don't. Because you're going to be like, the definition of insanity is trying the same thing over and over again, expecting different results. That's not the definition of insanity. The definition of insanity is repeating some dumb fucking thing you heard on the internet without ever looking it up and checking it. God. Uh, what makes me so grand? It's just an adjective uh, to describe the size of my wing. You can't just let it land like right on top of you, right? I mean, I've tried that, Paul Pierce. Also, I don't think you're the real part, Paul Pierce. I'm gonna, I'm gonna prove this. How many times were you stabbed? How many times were you stabbed and how many games did you sit out after it happened? Oh, that did work. Hey, we got it. Yeah, that was simpler than I thought it was. I just thought it was always gonna... Fuck you so hard. I feel like he probably would be on the Mount Rushmore. Mm, okay, hold on. I think I got something. And then bounce off of it maybe? And this is this is what I was talking about though when I was filling out my bracket. I just have, I have access to way too much analytical information now. And I looked at it, I looked at all, how Kentucky played against teams that shot the three this year. Yeah. And we're filling out our bracket. What? How? 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 What? How? Midair drop bounce? What? What is that? What is a midair drop bounce? Is that what I supposed to want to do? Is that, is that what it wants me to do? <laughs> Y'all need Jesus. On belay. Let's go. Let's go. Um, belay on. Just like that. I had to think about what I was doing there for a second. You know, what are we doing here? Okay, I guess just that. Fuck that up. How many hats am I bringing to Mexico? Uh, probably two. Not a lot. Uh. Why is that so awkward? I need, um, I need the relax. Um, okay. I, I, I didn't, I didn't know it was gonna happen there. Someone won the, someone got the billion dollar ticket for Mega Millions? They were in New Jersey. Well, I mean, they still have to live in New Jersey. What is happening here? 
I see where I fucked up. You don't have to be narcissistic to think you're gonna win the lottery. Well, I think you buy a ticket and then you automatically get a little hope, right? But I don't think anyone actually thinks they're going to win. But you buy the ticket because then you can do the thing like where you and your, you know, all your friends are like, this is what I would do with the money. This is what I would do, you know? They're like, I would buy this, I would buy this massive house. I would buy this, I would buy this. Oh, fuck me in the ball dick. Uh, statistically, you're most likely to win if you do one of those, like, groups, too, you know? Because, you know, more tickets. That was kind of a weird little ending right there. You like to buy the occasional ticket for the dream? Yeah, I mean, I'm kind of the same way. It's like, I'll buy a ticket when it's at what? Yeah, uh, the, my, I, I don't think I would have much drastic difference between 40, 40 million and uh, 400 million. I think that I think that would pretty much live the exact same. I think you would have the same amount of stuff to do. I don't think I have that, like, rich person lifestyle. You bought three tickets in your life? Like, tickets three times or three total tickets? Usually, usually if I am gonna buy, we'll buy, we'll buy a few. Okay, I, I see what I'm doing there. I feel like a bigger yacht, though, is just, like, more space to not enjoy. Like, I feel like a basketball court, a bowling alley. Like, what more do you want after the bowling alley in your house, right? Like, what more could you want? What did I do wrong there? A bowling alley is only 60 feet long? You can't... I, dude, my garage isn't 60 feet long. How many people... How Do you have 60 uninterrupted feet in your house? If so, party at Seems Unlikely's house. Whereas, like, I'm a decent bowler, as is. And I think I'll benefit from the added rotations. Oh, fuck me, right? The difference between having 40 and 400 million dollars. And then I talked about how, what could you really, how big of a house could you ever really want? Because like anything past like having a bowling alley, like that's, you're having too much house, right? Anything past that, you should just leave and go and do the thing. A basketball court, pickleball court, tennis court, whatever, and a bowling alley inside the house. You know, like a media room, cool. Like those things, you don't need anything like past that. You really don't, you obviously don't need that, but I'm even saying like as a obnoxiously rich person, like, anything past that is just, like, absolute obnoxious, ridiculous stuff, right? Oh. <laughs> that was a lot easier than I made it out to be. <laughs> but anyway, let's get back to it. Back to what now, putting a bowling alley in your house. Uh, when that with two opposing directions, the courageous snake will forge a path of its own. I don't know what I'm doing here. You had a ton of money, a bunch of fancy fancy Japanese toilets would be your priority. I feel like you could probably swing one. I probably, you could probably swing one of those right now. Nobody talks about anything on their podcast. They just talk shit. I, I had a podcast. It failed. I'm not starting another one. Yeah.
Oh, we got in there. Oh. Uh, what? Come on. I hit that first. Nature fact. Green dinosaurs are the natural predator of pink... Natural predator of pink triangles. I swear I can fucking talk. It's a very, very good game. Uh, so far, I like it a whole lot. Okay, we need to hit this twice, chat. I think. New plan. Is Mario Maker 2 dead? Um, I mean, it's... Relatively, I'd say. I think you need your... If you don't have anyone... If there's nothing new coming out for a game, and it's an online game, then it's going to be pretty dead. The fuck? Ah! Balls. Oh god, oh uh, no. Oh. Fucking swim. I guess, I guess you can definitely learn a lot about a person. By what they think that stands for. Um, am I safe? I'm safe. I'm safe. Okay. If I didn't break that, it would have came over and murdered me. You used to be innocent before the internet? Don't worry. Uh, okay. I see. Touch dizzy, get fuzzy. Touch dizzy, get fuzzy right there. Fuck that, in particular. Yeah, that's a bullshit spot. No, I lost my innocence when I made the Jeopardy category for Xwater and Zack, um, which was Urban Dictionary, or Pokemon moves by their Urban Dictionary. Definition, yeah, that was, that was when I Lost all my innocence. I don't need to win, but I, I I always like to feel like I played to my potential, or at least close to that, or gave myself an opportunity to be in, you know what I mean? Like Twitch Rivals the other day, like I wasn't bummed about that. You know, I thought I played, drove really good, even though I didn't have the result I wanted. Oh, did we get in there? Let's go, yeah. Let's go. Oh, fuck this spot in particular. This hack has some banger tracks. Yeah, this is a banger hack in general. This is a very, very good one. Um, I mean, I kind of thought just based on who made it, it was going to be a banger. Um... But it's very good. Mm, that's not what I want to do. Okay. Spring break? Oh, I guess that makes sense. You fucking fuck fuck. <laughs> what a bit. Eventually the whole Western world is going to forget who Jesus is, but we're going to fight to hang on to the holidays. I mean, I think the, I, I think the problem is most people that fight for him may have forgotten who he is to begin with. Loving thy neighbors and whatnot. Um, also, I don't think we're going to have any problem with keeping Christmas. And I'll tell you right now why. Because I fucking love presents. I fucking love presents. There you go. There you go. Revlock got lazy and left this level unfinished. Could you do us a favor and fill in the missing tiles? Oh. Cute. Cute. Well, 
that's cute. What essentially got me into speedrunning? Um, okay, so I was streaming, and I had been streaming um, for, I don't know, close to two years, right? I'd say. And I hadn't really shown anything for it. I didn't really have any viewers. I was mostly playing like Rust and Daisy and survival games like that. And if you guys have ever seen me play first-person shooters, I'm not a good shot. Um, and back then, those games were, you know, just really oversaturated. And anyway, my wife one day came home from work all frustrated because I was a loser. I had been watching games done quick, right? And so I kind of figured, all right, if I'm going to have to quit streaming one day, right? I at least want to get really, really good at one game. Then Mario Maker came out and I discovered Kaizo levels and then I ran out of Panga levels to play and um, there wasn't that many Kaizo creators at the time. There's like four people making Kaizo levels, you know? Uh, so once I ran out of Penga levels, and I was like, I didn't feel like there was like any hard levels in Mario Maker to play. Funny enough, think about that. At the time, I started speedrunning Dream World, and that's really when things, I guess, like I guess I started taking it like real seriously. Ah, shit! I've played an unhealthy amount of Balatro off stream. I'll say that. Unhealthy amount. I've played an offensive amount of Balatro off stream. I've played Balatro way more off stream than on. Yeah. Way more off stream than on. What am I doing here? Why do I have a controller crotch cam? Why, why would someone playing a video game have a con controller cam? Really? It's only a crotch cam if you're horny. I don't know what to do there. My favorite speedrun game to watch is probably like specifically Oats and Goats playing Super Metroid. And like that. Yeah, what kind of psychopath? Like, oh, there's 2.4 seconds to save. In Mickey Mouse's hidden tower for the NES. Bitch. What a bitch move. Woo! Oh, I wanted a boss! I wanted a boss! 